Hello Darts Nuts and welcome to Darts Review channel. In this video I'm going to be having a look at another set from the Harrow's 2020 range and this is the Harrow's Noctis and this is the bomb style or bullet style. Some people kind of get the styles mixed up but it's probably more of a bomb style. Anyway let's check them out. These are 23 gram 90% tungsten with a black titanium coating and a grey metallic coating in the grooves and they retail for £45.95. So it comes in this cardboard packaging. Uh, on the back you've got a picture of the two models. You've got the bomb shape and the straight barrel. And it also tells you about the coating. You've got a black titanium coating and a grey metallic coating. Just push that little hole and the tray comes out and the contents are inside a little plastic tray with a velvet covering and the darts fitted into a little plastic point holder and they come supplied with the super grip carbon in between and the Harrow's Prime Noctus flights. So I didn't see the darts fit with a black coated point and it's your classic John Law style bullet or bomb shape style. Uh, very popular shape with many people and it's got quite a smooth transition from the barrel to the nose which is nice to see. Don't often get that with these styles but as you can see it's nicely tapered there so Obviously it's a short barrel dart so most people are, are going to be gripping exactly where the grip is but um, like I always like to try front middle end grip I'll deliberately just grip it a little bit closer to the nose but for me that just feels very nice and the grip itself it's not as grippy as I was expecting at first I thought looking at the grip it looked quite uh, spiky but it actually feels more like a medium level surprising that it may feel a bit different when I come to throw it though but uh, it's got a nice feel so it should release easy and quite like that uh, grey metallic cotton in the grooves it's almost like a bluey greeny grey quite effective when the light's shining on it and as you can see it tapers a little bit towards the rear and then on the end of the barrel it's got these two natural silver rings so slightly indented in between them so just a little bit of grip there but overall I'd say it's medium level and feels a, a nice comfortable dart to hold but short darts are not for everyone and there's the super grip carbon stems and your Harrow's 100 micron prime flights. The darts fit with a 26mm black quarter point, there's a smooth transition from the point to the nose of the barrel and that front section is tapered and that's 11.8mm before you get into the main part of the barrel which is this kind of a ring grip with the angled rings and fairly wide grooves that's 14.8mm and then it tapers again that's 7.1mm you've got a small groove of 0.7mm then on the end you've got this section with the two rings and a slightly indented section that's 5.6mm length is 40mm width is 8mm that's 23.07 grams 23.07 again and 23.07 so perfectly matched and the full setup is 24.84 grams 
With nothing touched, the balance is towards the front and with the supplied setup, it moves very slightly behind the center point and this is the balance with medium in between short stems and standard flights. Obviously it's got a couple of smooth sections where it's not that grippy but on the rear part it's got them little uh, rings so you get a little bit of grip there but the main section of grip I'd say it's around medium level so 6 out of 10 for that. Just as I normally do I'm trying it at the front so it's probably not where I would naturally grip it I'd probably be gripping it a little bit further up the barrel so I am um, quite a bit on the smooth part here and got the stems tight enough <coughs> so <coughs> I'm not getting fully on the grip there so Probably not my uh, natural test of where I would be gripping it from, but it's a nice feeling dart. Uh. <laughs> but it's the kind of dart that I used like years ago, the kind of short bomb or bullet, bullet style John Law type. Some people call it bullet, some people call it bomb. I think it's more of a bomb style though, but I would say for most people you're going to naturally grip exactly where the grip is so I'm going to try that now and although that's in the middle of the dart it still kind of feels like a a normal kind of grip for me because it's only a short barrel but uh, it's a very pleasant dart to throw and like I said, when I first seen the grip, I thought it looked quite aggressive, but it's not aggressive at all. There is um, some grippiness because the grooves are quite widely spaced, but I'd say at best it's high medium. But for most people, I think it's probably just going to be medium level. But if you like a John Law style barrel, then I would say definitely give it a try and if you've never tried this kind of barrel style before this is certainly a nice one to start with okay how long was that three throws I had yeah anyway I think it was so I'll try it from the rear section now so on the rear it obviously slopes a little bit but there's still a little bit of grip there because those two silver rings are kind of slightly pronounced. I would probably say front and middle grippers it's going to be the best for. But because of that little bit of grippiness on the end of the barrel there. Some rear grippers may be happy with it but I think uh, front and middle is definitely the best spot because it's where the grip is on the barrel and it's where the best balance is. It's another nice looking dart but um, black darts I often think they look great when they're new but not so great when they've been battered and worn a bit.
Let's check out the ratings. Quite like the look of the dart with the black coating, but I'll give it 7.5 and I also like that little grey metallic coating in the grooves. Overall the grip is 6, that's obviously for the middle section and weight match was perfect so 10 quality overall very very good so 9.5 and value again it's not too expensive but uh, it is a fairly basic dart so 7.5 so there you go the Harrow's Noctis it's a really nice dart for me because it's the kind of dart I used to throw years ago so I still have quite a fondness for this kind of dart um, but like I said, if you've never tried this dart before, this style of barrel, it's worth a try at least once, because you just never know whether it's going to uh, suit you or not. But don't be put off by the grip, because like I said, it's not as aggressive as it looks. It's just a nice, pleasant feeling grip. Releases nice and easy. And I think most of the grippiness is coming from the width of the grooves. So I think it should be fine for most people. One of them grips that just suits a lot of styles. Um, I would say front to middle grippers will get the best out of it but it's a short barrel so you're always going to be gripping uh, around about the middle anyway because it's so short doesn't matter where your thumb goes depends how big your fingers are but even at the front I'm not far from the middle and at the rear again same thing so it's usually a very nicely balanced dart because of that but obviously you can alter that with the stems and flights. And that's why I often recommend people give this style a go because you just never know if it's going to suit you or not. So that's the end of the review. I hope you've enjoyed watching it and stick around for the gallery. And if you haven't subscribed, please do so. Happy darting.